people have seen such a different side of you lately that they are afraid to approach you. Please scroll on if this doesn't resonate. Fear of rejection, beauty for ashes, which means something burned down and you got beauty. You are beautiful inside and out. And I know I fumbled the bag. Like, people underestimated you, thought that nothing good was going to happen. Let, let's speak that out of your life. Mm, you have no fear. You are beautiful inside and out. You rose like a phoenix. That's what that means. Um, what else do you need to know? You saw through me. They're afraid of your intuition. Um, wow. They, they know that there must be something deeply spiritual about you. I have cried over you and I miss you. Now, it's not just one person. It could be romantic. But, it, you know, it could be so many other different scenarios. So, however it resonates. But if this is for you, you know who it is. And it's probably one of the last three or four people who've reached out to you. Um, a random... Well, hmm, I shouldn't say random. It felt random probably, but oh, it's time to forget. They are hoping you will forget how they fumbled. They know they fumbled. A lot of people are just wishing or hoping that you will grant them amnesty <laughs> to come back in. Um, whoa. Yeah. Amnesty. But they wonder what you're doing differently. How have you just risen like this? Everybody's talking about it. Everybody's talking about it. Settling. <laughs> Obsessed. You know, this is about the people who once thought that it'd be settling to be with you are now obsessed with you. That might be the title of this reading. That's a really big statement right there. They're wanting you to forget because they're looking at something you're doing. Could be social media following, could be something else. But they're just wondering, like, how do I do that? Like, why Why them? Why did they, you know, and maybe they don't realize the work that you've put in and that, you know, anyone could do it. They just have to put it out there. You know, that could be, that's part of it is but you know some people it's crazy like some people really just are afraid to put it out there or for whatever reason sometimes it's understandable and sometimes it's like hmm, it's just fear so let's speak that out of their lives like i really think that you should send energy to some of these people or really any of them really the, the way to block curses is to send love to your enemies to send peace um but i manifest that they'll do this in their own lives that's how we get to the new earth guys like hmm, let's manifest good things for these people i don't think they're your enemies but even if they are especially manifest good things for them that's how you break every curse forgive us our debt as we forgive our debtors it was divine intervention not walk in walk in love see that's what i'm talking about regarding the spiritualness the spirituality they see in you there's a whole lot of stuff that's happened that i think some public stuff has happened that people have witnessed and seen you know and been like whoa i didn't realize you were this protected i didn't realize you were this powerful like seriously there was some deep deep underestimating going on like people who were ashamed to say they knew you are now like bragging that they knew you when they didn't even know you all is forgiven <laughs> see what i mean oh, forgive us our debt as we forgive our debtors there they want you to forget they want you to forget and forgive now i know every time i mention anything about this people are always like well i can forget i can't forgive or i can forgive but i can't forget i know i know um one thing at a time you don't have to forget but just forgive just means they don't owe you anything you know like you don't have to be around them again you don't have to let them hurt you again but you also don't need to collect a debt from them one more card from here speak life oh i love when that card comes out it's been coming out ever since i started talking about speaking more positive um speak life over this situation i'm going to do that right now for you with this manifestation deck what's what are the three most important statements that you could possibly learn or get from this reading to end this reading like hmm, you are witty you have healthy habits you make peace wherever you go that's what i'm talking about here again make peace wherever you go send peace to them even the ones who may be trying to provoke you they will not prevail you have the victory you have healthy habits you're taking care of yourself you're taking care of yourself um spiritually especially that's how you're able to see through people you are witty like see here's what i'm getting is that for some people what you're what's going on is your wittiness here like because this has been coming out a lot which tells me i have a collective here that's witty that needs this that means you have a way of saying things of putting words together let's speak life I, you know people do not expect you to go in a positive direction it throws people off it it really does it breaks every curse mm, you're doing better like you're doing something different something way different now and i just i'm supposed to encourage you to walk in love that that's how the ascension happens 
to realize that we're all connected and that you need to love do unto others as you would have do unto others as you would have them do unto you like treat them the way you would want to be treated because you are connected to them seriously you are connected everybody's connected we're all connected to each other that's why we need to respect each other there's been a massive deception that's why so many people are going through so much right now and waiting for some stuff that's never going to happen the kingdom of heaven is inside you it's within you anyway you need to take care of yourself first and realize that everything going on in your life everything going on in your life nothing happens by accident nothing is by luck not one second of your life is by luck you have healthy habits you make peace wherever you go and you are witty it is spoken it is written and so it is amen